But this is a little bit of a different start to this video. Normally you'd have the arrow blah 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 reaction and it just goes instantly into it. But I thought I would talk real quick about, um, I don't know my feelings going into this episode because it is a big episode. It's Emily Betts last episode or at least her last episode as a regular. I mean I highly doubt we won't see her at least one more time next season considering it's its last but if this is truly the last time we're gonna say bye, soon say, say goodbye to her and Felicity, it sucks because she's one of the main reasons why I stick around with this show. You know, there are certain characters on certain shows that I, especially in the Arrowverse or at least the DC verse, that um, if they weren't there, I would be a lot less invested into the show. Like, uh, for example, on Flash, if Harrison Wells or Tom Cavanaugh wasn't there, I. I'd be mad. <laughs> you know, I, I, my, my investment in the show would shoot down a lot. Um, you know, and like Legends, it's kind of all ever changing, but like, you know, if if Sarah wasn't there, it's kind of like pooey. You know, that sort of thing. There's always at least one character that kind of makes the show for you, and Felicity is the character for Arrow for me. So it's going to be very interesting going into the next season without her. I am very nervous, excited, and a little sad to see what they're going to do with her. Uh, this for this episode to kind of like give her an exit. Um, I said last time that I think they're going to uh, have her die in the future um, and then we'll have her go into hiding in the present so that explains her absence. But yeah. Um, Alright, let's start Arrow season 7 finale. You gotta run. They have to run, right? Yep. Oh, 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 okay. <gasps> wow. Hey, guys. Oh, no. <laughs> Is that, um, Connor? Holy shit. Oh my god, she's... Oh, I love her! Yeah, baby! You can take down one guy. Thank you! Been missing you! Hi, Zoe! This will get them to move. Son of a bitch! Oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah, you really think Miko's gonna like redemption? No, not after this. Ah! He has freeze arrows. Are you kidding? The best. If people were correct in their thinking that Laurel and I couldn't change, well, we wouldn't be here helping you. Help yeah, I. Because I guess. Bad news, B. We just got 15 new targets. We don't have time to neutralize that many. A link. And now my little girl's a grown ass woman and one of the canaries. I know she can handle herself. And your kids. They're no slashes either, Felicity. They're like their parents. They're supposed to be living happy normal lives right now. That was the only thing that Oliver asked me to do. That's the only thing that I promised him I would do. I love you. I don't think Oliver's dead. I'm gonna be watching over both of you. Oh. This is about to be so dope. <laughs> His kicks, man! So fire! Okay, that's even more fire. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. The smug bastard. the attitude to have William. Ooh. Whoa! Oh, whoa! My eyes! Your allegiance to the Ninth Circle killed your mother. Your hatred of our father killed your mother. So if you're gonna kill me, do 
What? The nine circle answers to me. Or she's gonna die. Woo! All right, Mia. Ready when you are. Come on, what are you doing? What are you doing? Take care of mom. You got this. Maybe ten freaking more. So you are a born leader, and I think you are more than ready to rebuild and take control of the canaries. I don't understand. So what's on your plan for what happened? It should be us. You'll be fugitives. We spent the last two decades living in. Oh, she's not gonna die. I should be thanking you. You got me off that island. You never really told me how you got on that island. Yeah. It's a long story. Look where she wrote me going. The spirit of this place will live long, long after we're gone. Inspire so many people. They will carry on your legacy. It sounds like a cycle for good. Far better than that. Full of fight. Oh, Emily. Every fiber of their being. Oh, look at. City heart is just pounding <laughs> right now. I s <sighs> fuck you. How would you propose? I keep the balance. Will you help me save Bear or not? No, but I will give you the means to save them. Tell me what you need in exchange. Whatever the multiverse requires to survive the crisis that is looming. I have watched you die. Yeah. I cannot prevent his passing. Ah. Uh. But he can prevent the death of countless more, including you. I just wanted us to be all together one last time. What do you mean one last time? Just because you're a fugitive, it doesn't mean we can't still communicate. Oh, things are going to be different this time. I wish I got to know him. I know, but he lives on in the two of you. Oh my 
my god. <laughs> waterfall over here oh my lord oh what <laughs> thank god I was about to say what if they're just faking it oh my god please have them reunite right now on screen it won't happen but it's fine it's whatever was a flood. That was a freaking flood. A freaking flood on aisle three. Oh, Jesus. You know, <laughs> I was like, oh, I might be fine. I might cry like a little bit. It wasn't even me crying. It was just like my emotions just fuck. <laughs> I am gonna miss her so much. Ugh. I'm gonna miss her so much. It's gonna be like a whole watching this show now. It's gonna be a big just chunk of it missing. I mean, I'm glad Oliver's not dead. Yay! But still. Yeah, because I was like, I don't... I wonder where he is. I hope... Oh, I really, really, really hope we get a glimpse of... Um, like where he is, you know, just in the final episode, we can see him and Felicity just one more time, please. <laughs> Emily, you're not watching this, but Emily Bat, come on, can you just skip this one one scene, you know? I don't I don't think I don't think you'd like say no to that or I think you'd be down for that. Let's make that happen. Let's make December Shayla happy. That'd be top notch, you know? Um yeah, because this show will end in December because of the crossover. It'll end or it'll either end in December or it'll end January. I have a feeling it'll end in December though. There's no way they would. Yeah, it's gonna end in December because the crossover always happens like the week before the mid season or at least yeah, it'll end in December. Oh, yeah, watching the. I think I got more. I I definitely didn't get emotional necessarily. Um, thinking about the characters, I definitely got more emotional watching the actors act their scenes, if that makes any sense. Like that scene in the bunker with the OTA, Oliver, Felicity, and uh, Diggle, and just watching Emily and Steven like try to keep it together was definitely like really heart-wrenching to me. You gotta think, man, I've always like read, you know, when actors have to say goodbye to actors, on shows, it's, we're saying goodbye to a character, they're saying goodbye to a family member, you know, and that's, it's a lot harder for them, and you, it, it's, it's, it's all we're saying goodbye to Felicity, but it's also Steven saying goodbye to Emily, you know, and that, 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 I think that's the thing that got me more, is the fact that you could just, it's, it's them saying goodbye to each other on screen, you know, because they're not going to see each other for, I mean, obviously, they're, family in real life, but <laughs> um, they just are no longer going to work together, or at least they're no longer going to work together for an extended period of time, and that that's, that's heart-wrenching, you know? Man, I mean, I don't even want... I mean, the episode was good. I kind of don't want to, like, talk about anything else, because it's... This was... This was a... Like, the main thing that I got from that was Felicity's goodbye, you know? Because I, I went in, we found out, I don't know, a couple weeks ago that she was, or about a month ago that she was leaving, so it's it's been, it's been keyed up. So the rest of the finale was kind of, um, 
not necessarily overshadowed by the fact that she's leaving, but it was definitely like, that's what I was thinking during it. It was just like, God damn it, this is gonna be the last hour I've seen Felicity. Fuck. At least I hope, I hope not. I hope she comes in at least the final two episodes of next season. Like, that'd be sweet. You know, just the crossover and the final episode, that'd be cool. Um, but yeah, I wonder what they're gonna do because Felicity going with the monitor, like, Felicity going with the monitor. Well, she did, technically. But Oliver going with the monitor, like, I wonder how he's going to integrate into next season with our characters without it being a, hey, the, you know what I mean? Like, Felicity would obviously be like, Oliver, that sort of thing. So I don't know how they're going to do it. It's going to be interesting to see how they're going to play out the final ten, bleh, final ten episodes. Uh, but yeah, um, I hope we see more of Mia. Um, I really like her. She's a lot of fun. Um, I hope we see more of everybody in the future because I like the characters more than I uh, thought I would. So that's fun. Um, but yeah, that was the... We have 10 more episodes left. That's very sad. Arrow's still... You know, as much as I love Legends, you all know I love Legends. Legends holds a very special place in my heart. Um, and it's it's... It's one of those things where it's like, currently, it's my favorite show to watch of the Arrowverse, but I think at the end of the day, me ranking the Arrowverse shows, it's Arrow's always going to end up being on top, you know? No matter its flaws, no matter its, its ups and downs, it's just going to, it's the show I'm most connected to the characters in this show. Out of all of the Arrowverse shows that we have, I am more I am way more connected to the characters in these shows than I am in the other ones. And I always will be, you know? I was I was skeptical going into The Flash. I didn't even watch the first, first 15 episodes of The Flash because I was like, I don't want to see this, you know? I don't even think I watched the first, I think I watched the final two episodes live and that was it. You know, because I was just very like, oh no, I'm good with Arrow. Arrow's cool. Arrow's fine with me. Uh, but then I watched it because my mom was like, hey, it's pretty good. It's pretty damn good. So, you know, and I, it's always been, it's always been Arrow. You know, I'm all, I'm always going back to this show. It's always going to be the one that's going to make me cry the most or most, the most emotions poured out into the Arrow shows. This is the one, 100%. It will always, it will always be this one. You know, we've had five seasons of The Flash, four seasons of Legends, four of Supergirl, but I don't get as emotionally drained or emotionally, like, invested than I do with Arrow. It'll always be, and at this point, it's kind of, like, solid, like, 100%. It's going to be that forever, you know? This show changed. I'm acting like it's ending. I mean, this was felt so much like an end, um... But this show changed my life. This show, is, this show is one of the reasons why I got into the superhero world. Without it, I wouldn't be into it, you know? I wouldn't be into a lot of things that I'm into now. So it's just, it has to be, it has to be my favorite. You know, it has to be my favorite out of the Arrowverse shows. It just has to be. Um, but yeah, that's the end of this reaction. Next time I'll see you guys will be for, most likely, Arrow Season 8. Hmm, that's crazy. Final season. Lots of endings coming, guys. Lots of endings coming. <laughs>